Welcome to the virtual tour of the Duquesne University School of Nursing's Learning and Simulation Center. The use of technology in simulation training continues to develop as an important part of healthcare education, and the School of Nursing is proud to provide our students with the latest learning technology. Both undergraduate and graduate students use our patient simulators and equipment to practice all aspects of patient care. We'll begin our tour in the Robert and Mary Wise Broad Foundation Fundamentals Skills Lab. An increasingly important aspect of simulation is the usage of wearable technology, such as AvTrake and AvCath. This equipment gives students the ability to interact with a live actor referred to as a standardized patient. AvTrake allows for simulating care of a patient with a tracheotomy, while AvCath provides hands-on experience with an indwelling catheter. Both simulators provide learners with authentic human interaction and communication as the wearer can respond immediately to the learner's actions. The other half of the main lab is our basic care area, which is primarily used by beginning nursing students practicing basic care skills. The beds house a variety of medium fidelity simulators. Our health assessment area is fully equipped with exam tables and wall diagnostic equipment. In addition, the center also features four individual exam rooms for standardized patient encounters. Each room has a camera and microphone to record and stream the patient exam to a faculty instructor. Next, let's visit the Ann Lancy Glazner simulation room. A control center separates the two simulation rooms and provides a space for nursing faculty to observe and record the patient care scenarios. This allows the faculty to guide the simulation without being in the patient care area, enabling students to function more independently and to develop critical thinking skills. These rooms also feature video projections and audio effects to simulate various clinical locations. Through high fidelity simulation, students gain clinical knowledge and skills, as well as critical thinking, teamwork, and leadership which are all vital skills for today's nurses. SimMan demonstrates authentic clinical problems from the simple to the complex, problems that nurses encounter every day such as post-surgical complications or cardiac arrests. Just like human patients, SimMan can communicate and talk with the learner. Because SimMan is fully programmable and prepared to respond appropriately to any treatment, he can demonstrate adverse outcomes when learners do not implement appropriate nursing interventions. In the safe setting of the simulation center, errors become opportunities for learning. By providing immediate feedback, our students can adjust their care plan accordingly. After each simulation, students regroup in the Gladys L. Eusted Conference Room for debriefing about the session. Each session is recorded so that students can review their personal performance to see their strengths as well as areas to improve for the future. Another recent advance in the world of simulation is through the usage of augmented reality or AR. Through a partnership with Loomis, Students in the lab can visualize layers of anatomy, which are projected live onto the mannequin. These advanced learning technologies in the School of Nursing demonstrate our commitment to educate competent and caring nurses. Nurses prepared to become the leaders of the profession. Thanks for joining us on this virtual tour of Duquesne University School of Nursing Learning and Simulation Center. We hope you'll visit us in person.